So, we have our first bloom. And I'm so happy that all of my plants are alive because y'all that have been on this journey with me know that it was so hard, especially being without lights for so many days. Um, and a lot of the plants were really cold. They were really mad at me and it really showed. But they're bouncing back really lovely. And it's time for most of them to go outside. And the ones that are outside, they seem to be doing pretty good. I have some new things, but some of the same things. Now, this one was really hard to germinate. I can't believe that butter crunch is there. And this is all my plants that I had before. I put them together to stay warm. Uh, the beans are a leggy mess right now, but I know the sun is coming out. And I'm going to top off the soil, too, to see if that will help them kind of push through, as we like to say. But look at this. Remember on the last video? So this is my first time, well, my second time, successfully growing microgreens. And I have two trays. And this is my herb garden. It was in the little small cell trays that y'all saw, but my dog kicked it over, of course, so... We're just going to see how it work. If it doesn't, I have more seeds. And uh, I'm going to just try not to get upset. These are taking forever. We'll see what happens. I'm not going to get upset. And this is my celery plant. It came from a cutting. And it's actually root bound now. So pretty soon, I'm going to transfer it to one of these pots or bags or something. And my cabbage is here. It's doing pretty good. I'm thinking about going ahead and cutting one. Barbara and Shirley in there still duking it out for space. And I actually do have successful sprouts. These are some, I believe, muncher cucumbers. The zucchinis, I have two of them. I also have okra. So we went from this during the storm to what y'all saw. And the results are definitely worth it. Please like and subscribe and comment.